show you how I feel. Dear Logan, today is our day. The one day in history where we get to make history and join our lives and family under God. I vow you will never be alone in any struggle you face or challenge life decides to throw our way. I vow I will always be, <coughs> try to be the best man and husband I can possibly be for you. And that is what you deserve. Logan Whit Bass, I love you more than anything in this life and I cannot wait to show you that for the rest of my, of my life. Robbie, we stand here today to pledge our life, love, and commitment to one another, but we can't forget where it all began. I never could have imagined that the frat boy who I told my whole family was not my type would be standing here today. So I stand here, proudly humbled, to start off our marriage right by setting the record straight and admit how horribly wrong I was about the kind of person that you are. I can't promise you a perfect life, a life without the hard times or the disappointments, but I can promise a lifetime of laughter, adventures, and memories that will cherish in our rocking chairs. I make these vows today not as promises but as privileged privileges. I am privileged to get to love you and support the man you are today, the husband that you'll be tomorrow, and the person that you hope to become. So in this and every lifetime, I love you, Robbie. You shine brighter than the stars in the sky. I am yours and I know you are mine. You're the one I want to be next to. I want to live in that light. My love, you shine so bright. You shine so bright. So bright. I will be your shelter when you need a place to hide. You will each fall short, but your shortcomings can be overcome through the choice to love and the choice to offer grace, with a reliance on the strength of Christ's love for us and on the tribe who joins you here today. Now at the foundation of this covenant relationship are the vows that you offer each other. I, Robbie, take you, Logan, to be my wedded wife. I, Logan, take you, Robbie, to be my wedded husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. Till death do us part. Until death do us part. Logan, in the eyes of God and the people gathered before you, you are now husband and wife. Robbie, please kiss the bride. In my honor to introduce to you for the first time, 
Mr. and Mrs. Robert Bruce Bass III. So don't prove me wrong. Your mom and I love you both very much, and we look forward to what you have in store. At the exact moment that the two of you officially became husband and wife, this clock was stopped. When you go through the trials with highs and lows, you'll have this to look at in every home that you share together. To remember how you felt in that moment and what's made your relationship so incredibly special. I will always be here for you guys, no matter where you are, and I love you both. My wish for you two is that you have a lifetime of happiness, love, and laughter. While your story started a mere four years ago, it is only just the beginning. I hope that you continue to embrace the role of being each other's partners in life, and that you stay patient and continue to show each other compassion and grace in the many years to come. <laughs> 